Eight signs you're more than just an empath. You're a psychic empath. Hello, empathic explorers. Today, we're delving into the intricate world of psychic empathy, a realm where the ability to perceive and connect with emotions transcends the ordinary. If you're here, you might be on a quest to understand the depths of your emotional insights, realizing that you go beyond the typical bounds of empathy. As a psychic empath, you may find yourself internally experiencing the emotions of others without the need for explicit cues. For those navigating the terrain of psychic empathy, establishing a protective barrier becomes crucial to prevent emotional fatigue and overwhelming sensations. Many empaths, however, are unaware of their unique gift and the need for such boundaries. This lack of awareness often leads to emotional exhaustion until the moment they recognize and embrace their empathic abilities. It's essential to distinguish psychic empathy from the more common human empathy that almost everyone experiences. What sets psychic empaths apart is their discernment of hidden emotional currents, unveiling pain, fear, or joy that often eludes others. This heightened empathic aptitude extends beyond emotions to encompass energy fields, auras, and the vibrancy within living beings, such as animals and plants. Are you pondering the possibility that you might be a psychic empath? Stay tuned as we explore eight signs that might unveil this unique gift within you. If this resonates with your journey, don't forget to express your support by liking and sharing this message, shedding light on the path for fellow empaths, embracing their extraordinary abilities. Number one, finding comfort alone time. Discovering you're an empath is a gradual process like watching a flower bloom over time. It kicks off when you recognize your empathic nature and continues as you work on your natural talents. While you might have these abilities innately, unlocking their full potential takes effort and patience. A newfound love for alone time surfaces as your empathic powers grow. You start appreciating the tranquility, a calm escape from the hectic energy of crowded places. As a result, you seek moments of quietness, whether surrounded by nature or in your favorite cozy corners. Solitude becomes a way to recharge as you navigate the empathic journey. Number two, riding the emotional roller coaster. Being an empath means absorbing and feeling the emotions swirling around you, leading to a roller coaster of moods throughout the day. Caught in these emotional storms, your feelings become unpredictable. One moment, you're filled with joy, only to plunge into sadness the next as you sense someone else's pain. Managing these emotional ups and downs can be draining, sapping your energy. That's why it's crucial for empathic folks to adopt simple shielding techniques, protecting themselves from being overwhelmed by emotional waves. The empathic path demands emotional awareness and a commitment to self-care. Number three, the toll of emotional challenges. Certain environments, like hospitals, cemeteries, or refugee camps, Hold a multitude of intense emotions that surround empaths like a whirlpool. You can't just walk into these places unprepared. It'll drain your vitality and leave you powerless. While you yearn to offer comfort to those in pain, stepping into these socio-emotional challenges without proper readiness can leave you drowning in emotions, leaving you drained. In extreme cases, the intensity of these emotions might leave you feeling crushed and gasping for air. So it's vital to equip yourself to navigate such situations or risk being overwhelmed by emotional turmoil. Number four, the constant vigilance. As an empath, it might take some time to grasp, but it becomes second nature. Once you become familiar with your gift, living amidst a sea of emotions, you develop a sharp sensor that distinguishes between positive and negative energies with clarity. Your sensitivity to negative vibes around you is especially strong, acting as warning signals that call for discernment and action. It's like these signals are sounding an alarm, prompting you to extend help or step back to avoid being dragged into negativity. The empathic life has its twists and turns, but as you refine your senses and stay attuned to your surroundings, you can use your gift to build meaningful connections and make a positive impact on the world. Number five, energy sickness strikes unexpectedly. For empaths who haven't quite nailed the techniques to protect themselves emotionally, it's not unusual to physically feel someone else's emotions as if they were your own. Picture standing next to someone radiating sadness or fear, and in an instant, those feelings crash through you like a turbulent sea. As if that's not enough, the physical discomforts of those emotions become your own. 
The intensity of this emotional whirlwind determines how uneasy it gets, stirring your insides and bringing waves of nausea at the most unexpected times. Whether it's the fog of worry, glimmer of fears, or the turbulent ups and downs of anxiety from others, all of it pulses through your veins and ruins your day like a magnet. To survive in a world buzzing with emotion, mastering the art of shielding is crucial to protect your well-being. Number 6. Feeling compelled to dive into others' hopes and issues. Empaths are a unique bunch known for their boundless compassion, exceptional empathy, and a deep desire to make the world a better place. For them, it's not just a job or a hobby, it's their reason for being. Their natural inclination towards other people's problems and passions is nothing short of captivating. Being able to delve into the depths of people's hearts, accurately diagnose the root cause of their issues, and guide them towards relief. As you touch the lives of others with your healing abilities, you become aware of the dreams they hold. It's as if their desires become yours, and you work tirelessly to see their dreams come true. With every shared victory, you're genuinely happy for them. The feeling is so overwhelming that you're not bothered about playing a part in their success. It's a win for both of you. As an empath, positively impacting others propels you, aiming for the betterment of the world through uplifting its people. Number 7. An ever-flowing torrent of emotion from within. As an empath, you feel things on a deeper and more visceral level than most. Your emotions are intense, a storm that rages inside you with no signs of letting up. Unlike others, your sadness isn't a passing moment of grief, but a constant stream of unrelenting sobs. While it may seem like a curse, mastering empathic abilities means accepting and processing emotions the way you do. In fact, it's crucial for your mental and physical health. You shouldn't shy away from fully experiencing the tide of feelings engulfing you because each passing wave builds your resilience. Training yourself to deal with complex emotions is vital so they don't stagnate and hinder your mental well-being. As an empath, you're the master of your emotions, acutely aware of their arrival and departure, understanding that they mustn't weigh you down. Only when you can harness the storm from within will you thrive amidst the most challenging emotions. Number 8. Respecting your own feelings. As an empath, a significant lesson is learning to prioritize your emotions. You understand that you can't adequately tend to others' needs unless you value and care for yourself first. It's like tending to a garden. You can't expect to harvest the best fruits unless you nurture the soil and understand its needs. By putting a premium on yourself, you can establish healthy boundaries that allow you to help others while preserving your own well-being. It enables you to regulate the flow of energy so you don't lose yourself in the chaos of being a conduit. Embracing your emotions is the first step in treating them with the respect they deserve, shaping your approach to life into a more mindful and effective one. As you deepen your appreciation of yourself, you can demand the same respect from others. We've delved into the world of psychic empaths, and now it's your turn to share your thoughts and experiences on this fascinating topic. Drop your insights in the comments section below. We'd love to hear from you. For those who resonate with being a psychic empath, remember to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell to stay tuned for more insightful content. Your active engagement keeps our community thriving. And here's something special for you. Check out the link in the description for a free book and information on one-on-one -on -one consultations. It's our way of supporting you on your empathic journey. Thank you for being a part of our community. Until next time, have a wonderful day, everyone.